Put Cohen here, Cohen on content and all things digital out of home. We'll close that up, take that off, turn that off, and like that because I got important stuff. I, last one of the year, which I mean the year's almost over, so I hope it's the last one, right? We had the last board meeting of the year at the Digital Signage Federation. A lot of stuff. Uh, starting the conversation leading up to the Digital Signage Expo, as you know, that's our industry trade show, which will be in Las Vegas again, bigger and better than ever. And Jason's going to put that, what do you call it, the URL thing here. You've got to go to the website because you got to see there's a bunch of new stuff and uh, there's a lot leading up to the exhibits, a lot of new stuff there. You know, the, the training programs, the Digital Signage Experts programs, keep growing. I think uh, Braun Consulting has now certified like 62,000 people in 10 countries. What that means to us is we're, we're out of that business of trying to guess as to whether or not somebody knows something about our business. We're out of that part, you know, where it, there was always that six month lead time to try to get somebody up to speed and say, no, we're not the kind of AV that you put in a hotel. No, we're not computers that we're digital out of home. This is how it all works. These are the steps to getting your business set up. We're, we're out of that. There are now qualified, certified people all over the world where we can be doing our recruiting within our our own industry. And uh, accolades or kudos or whatever to the Digital Signage Expo for getting all that set up and for Braun Consulting. Alan Braun, I mean this is, he's ending his year as Chairman of the Digital Signage Federation, becomes Chairman Emeritus, that's how it works. Uh, and I'm coming in as, as your new chairman. You know, he's so smart. He's like, he's like one of those guys that, uh, you know, you remember him from school. You remember him from, from graduate school. You know, you didn't know everybody. It wasn't like undergraduate school or even high school. We didn't know everybody, but there was always that one guy that just always seemed to have the answer, or at least you thought it was the right answer. That's Alan Braun. Uh, and these training programs they've put together are just, they're just the best. Uh, so anyway, go to, that, go to the website for DSE, make sure you got all your stuff together. And by the way, if you're a first time exhibitor, make sure you join the Digital Signage Federation first and get your booth space discount, because that will more than offset the dues. Speaking of, we have 230, 232 corporate members now. Uh, and, and literally thousands of individual members. I don't really have that, that number. Uh, and the Federation is going to be doing some new things. You know, the first year, uh, I think it was Rich Cooley was the, the first year we started this. Uh, the pre and he did, you know, got the golf tournament started and, you know, started a lot of conversation, I'll call it, within the organization, you know, took advantage of LinkedIn and some of those web things, and everybody started to get to know each other. Then, then, um, I, oh my God, Bob, I, I'm going to get slapped for not remembering. Bob developed that um, the certification thing, the seal. So, in order to do that, we had to develop these standards, business standards, and they, they, it really worked out in helping mold our industry. Uh, then Alan, what Alan did when he came in is he got us so well organized. You know, our committees are really focused, they really do their work, and they're not just, you know, they're not just board members, in fact, very few board members. When you look at these committees, different companies have assigned different people that really have a grip on a particular area. And then those people have put together their committees and they really do a good job. So more applause for Alan for that. Me, yeah, I've got a big mouth in case you never noticed. And uh, I've been complaining about the research that's published in our industry. Now, I'm not saying it's not good stuff and I haven't said it's not good stuff, but it's not specific stuff. Certainly we publish and you know, that's off to the DPAA for having set all that up, but certainly we publish good um, 
good research in what happens as far as audience measurement, measuring viewership in our networks. But the business itself, you know, it grew 21%, it grew 9%, it grew 11%, it grew 12%. Next year it's going to, it's, it, it, it's too, too much of a cloud. So what I want to do is, is use, under the auspice of Digital Signage Federation, and the, the membership that we have, is try to break it down into, you know, I got to get the kids in to give me the right words. Is it silos? Is it buckets? Is it verticals? I don't know what it is. It's parts of our business. What's happening in the screen business? Not, not this one big cloud of everything. What's happening with screens, media players, uh, of service? What's going on with the field service organizations and their business? Content, that's, you know, that's me. That's, I'm all about the content. What's going on in that industry? Who's, who's stepping to the front of that wave, the front of that curve? What's going on in their business? And that's what I'm looking about, the reporting part, the overall part of the business. And of course, ad supported networks because hey, that's what I have. Uh, but I want to get it broken down and good, solid research. You can't argue with it. You know, it's a turn the key, there it is, the right number. So that's what I'm going to be focused on uh, next year and expect to hear from me uh, is saying I need you to be ponying up some data. Uh, covered DSC, DSF. Uh, some of my rants in the last year, uh, I made a comment that a screen is a screen is a screen is a screen. When you buy your screens, you got to be thinking about who's the people. Okay, I took a lot of heat for that. A screen is a screen is a screen is a screen. Look. If you go to LG and you say, I want a 42 inch screen and this is what that does. You go to Panasonic and say, I want the same thing. You go to Samsung and want the same thing. Look, this guy's got a pixel, that guy ain't got a pixel, whatever. It's the same, the screens work. That's what I'm talking about. I'm not talking about when you're looking for specialty things like I gotta go to NEC because NEC makes this thing that's exactly what I need in the quantities and the distributions that I need. I gotta go to Micro tiles, because micro tiles can assemble the right stuff with the what do you call those in between the in those video walls? The thinner the bezel, the bezel the right word. I think that's an ashtray my grandmother used to have. But anyway, I'm not talking about that kind of stuff. I'm talking about overall. The importance that I'm trying to make is it's people. It's people. It's not the technology. It's not the what they made in the factory. Look, you could have the greatest piece of equipment, there is the greatest media player that was ever made. But if you can't get it delivered, if you can't find out where it is on the train, on the truck, on the boat, if, if it shows up and it's sitting in the box, and by the time you get it, it's out of warranty, is there somebody that you can talk to that's going to take your side and is going to say, hey, I found where they are, here's where they are, I went back to the factory, I got this taken care of for you. That's what I'm talking about. It's the people in every part of our business. That's what, uh, it's not that, oh gee, this guy's got this many pixels and that guy's got that many daxels and whatever else they have behind those screens. Digital Signage Federation. This is the last part of my, my rant today. Elections. This is important. This is not one of these organizations where, you know, the board sits around and says, hey, let's elect this guy and let's elect that guy. This is not, as, as Alan said, this is not an old boys network, even though he and I are two of the old boys. This is serious stuff. You know, when you're talking about over 230 corporate members and thousands of individual members, there's a lot of responsibility here. And you've got to have some say-so. Uh, Jason, I'm going to put that URL here. The election starts today, right now, when you see this. Go to this website. I assume you're a member, and vote. Now there's um, 11 seats up for either re-election or election. Four of the past board members are running for re-election. You will find on there, alphabetically, the names everybody's running, the re-election up here and then, then everybody else. Pick 11, and from the total of the two categories, pick 11. I'm not gonna campaign for anybody here, I, I could. But what you'll see is you'll see their the organization, their function within the organization, a brief bio, and their picture. 
Because you may know somebody and just not know their names. Oh, that's so-and-so. I know she's smart. I know he works hard. That kind of thing. Again, in that URL, I'm going I'm to take Jason and throw him off his desk if he doesn't leave it there long enough for everybody to go there. Because uh, got these elections are important. Uh, and while you're there, by the way, you can click through to the DSF website. I don't know if the new one is up yet or not, but navigate around and see what's going on. All right, that's what I got. Uh, Happy New Year, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa, Festivus for the rest of us, and like that. And I'll see you next year, and our industry is skyrocketing. We're exploding, every part of it, and I'm just so knocking on all the things that might be wood right there as to how good things are going to be even better next year. That's it. Goodbye. Have a good time.